गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट टुडे इन क्लास ट्वेल्थ इकोनॉमिक्स आई एम गोइंग टू टीच अ न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज कॉल्ड नेशनल इनकम फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड इन दिस चैप्टर व्हाट आर द एग्रीगेट्स माय डे स्टूडेंट्स एग्रीगेट्स मींस द थिंग्स व्हिच विल बी गोइंग टू एड प्लस माइनस so in this chapter i am going to begin with a very little example what is the national product and what is the domestic product okay clearly we have to understand the first thing is that when we are talk about the domestic product it is called the product or goods or services whatever the goods and services produced in our territory suppose in india wherever the territory is located that is called territory so whatever the goods and services produced in our territory okay so you next thing is that that should be a final consumption what is this my dear student the three criteria for the domestic product is that first that should be produced within a territory second all the final goods and services and third is that the question arises in your mind sir in india there are different foreign companies are also producing some goods and services exactly so what will we do simple what suppose i am going to take example of our indian company tata and one foreign company that is lg okay very correct suppose tata is producing 100 rupees product and lg is producing 50 rupees product so your total domestic product is 150 what do you understand here we are call that what whatever the collective goods and services produced in our territory so in our country different multinational companies as well as our own indian company simple understand that here you are able to understand tata is our national company it's so, okay and lg is our foreign company so whatever the goods and services both they are producing that collectively is known as domestic product next is that it is called domestic product but if you want to know sir what is the national product national product means the company the indian company only we are talking about indian company who produce goods and services okay when we are talk about national it means it is our indian company who produce goods and services it means what when we are talk about so only we are going to take tata okay suppose i am going to take only tata who is indian company who produce goods okay here you can say that sir what about the person who are earning in the abroad okay very true suppose ramesh is working in kuwait most of the families members as you know that different persons are working abroad they send money in our economy okay so ramesh on 10 rupees suppose suppose ramesh on 10 rupees who is working in kuwait okay so what will happen next so we will going to add 110 rupees now the question arises in your mind sir some foreign foreigner also earning income in our country for example for example 
if american person earning income in india it means it is not our national product it comes under domestic product but it not comes under national product so what will we do suppose sam who earn sam a american person who earn income in our country the income of sam is rupees 20 rupees so what will we do you have to deduct then you got 190 how to cut 90 the simple the company who is producing you first add them whatever the goods and services next Ramesh who earned income from abroad that is 10 rupees and deduct 20 rupees the Sam who worked in India and send money to America so that is called that is called national product so if you are going to calculate this thing simply you you assume Ramesh as X okay or Sam as Y okay you calculate domestic product first you have already calculated domestic product first that is 150 rupees okay plus net factor income from abroad that should be denoted x minus y x means the person who earn income from abroad that is ramis y denoted sam an american person who earn income in our country that should be deducted what will we observe my dear student here you simple you are going to do that 150 minus 50 rupees earned by LG company in India okay that is true it is a foreign company whatever the income earned in our country by LG it is send it back to the foreign okay now plus Ramesh income that is 10 rupees minus Sam income that is 20 rupees what you got simply 50 100 110 minus 20 that is 90 rupees again you see this with the help of the formula you can also observe simply whenever you are going to calculate the national product no issue you first calculate the domestic product with the help of this way and calculate the net factor income from abroad the net factor income from abroad means whatever the income earned by our Indians in foreign okay minus whatever the income earned by foreigners in our territory that should be deducted it is a simple my dear student so 90 rupees is called our national product so I hope my dear student you understand this topic very well in coming video I will explain how to calculate the different aggregates okay thank you